I am Dr. Sunita Rana Agarwal from Dr. Agarwal Hospitals, Bangalore, and I've come here to tell you that we have just come back from giving a scientific talk as well as holding a medical camp at the G20 International Yoga Festival held at Vrindavan, Uttar Pradesh, comes under Mathura district, and this area is considered to be Golu, which means it is belonging to Radha Krishnan. For those services, we had also gone there. This is a very, very beautiful location where we gave a scientific talk on autologous DNA therapy where we take one drop of blood from the patient, make his own DNA, his own fetal stem cells, give it back as injections to the patient. So our first part of the medical camp, we started at the original house of Lord Krishna where he lived with his father Nanda Baba and Yashoda Maya and brother Lord Balram. From there we came down to the International Yoga Festival where we gave a scientific lecture following which all the delegates who had come for the yoga festival we were giving them also injections. There were a lot and lot of saints and peers who had come from all over that region and to these people also we were very grateful because it is with the blessings that the peace is maintained in our country because of the saints and all their blessings with us. Okay. This all we had done there. Now I have a little request from all our viewers. This all was done on Yamuna Jayanti, the day Yamuna mother came down to earth. So this on 26th and 27th of March, they were also conducting the Yamuna Aarti, where it is a pledge was taken that Mother Yamuna also will be clean. Our Pujya Swamiji Chitanand Saraswati, 36 years ago, took the pledge to clean Mother Ganga. And today, we have got back the water samples that tells us the oxygen level of Mother Ganga has reached what it used to be before. Same now, if with all your help, we can do for Mother Kaveri. August 3rd is Adi Peruku, which is supposed to be Mother Kaveri's Jainti, 